All right, so Kevin, Kevin and Randy uh, have a jar containing 67 coins, all of which are either quarters or nickels. The total value of the coins in the jar are 1175. How many of each type do they have? So um, X, we're just, it's, this is going to be two equations, two unknowns, and actually I'll set it up for uh, um, quarters will be Q, and then nickels will be N. So total together we have 67 coins. And then if we have um, 0.25 times the number of Q plus the nickels, right? Yeah, 0.05 times N, we end up with 11.75. So all we have to do is substitution. And then to do that, all we're gonna do is we can just make it so like N is equal to 67 minus Q. So we'll have 0.25 Q plus, or here's our substitution. Um, 105.67 minus Q is equal to 11.75. So we have here 0.25 Q plus 3.35 minus 0.05 Q still the 11.75. Okay, so subtract this so I get 0.20 Q and then subtract 3.35 from 11.75 and I end up with 8.40. by 0.20 by 0.20. Uh, I was supposed to block this out. Um, and then I end up with Q. Yeah, it gets me 42 quarters. I was supposed to block out the top, but <laughs> didn't pay attention. Okay, um, all right, so we have Q, so 42 plus N, this is the first equation we wrote, is equal to 67, so minus 42, minus 42, so we get N is equal to two, five, so 25 nickels. So 25 nickels and 42 quarters, and that's it. All right. I hope this helps you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.